Hi, my name is Joseph Hempel. I work for Prime Camera here in Houston, Texas. Today, I'm going to show you how to change the mount on your Vericam LT from EF to PL. It's simple, it's easier than you think, and that's why it's today's quick tip. Note that this becomes increasingly easier if you remove all the accessories. Next, I'm gonna turn the camera on its end. I'm gonna get myself a one and a half millimeter Allen wrench and you have two set screws that are sit at about, about 10.30ish and about 3.30ish on the camera. They're on the side ring that's right behind the mount. Go ahead and take your Allen wrench and start removing these screws. Don't remove them completely, but back them out enough to where you can just about see them coming out. Next, we're gonna go grab our PL mount, remove the blue tape, now you're gonna take your EF mount, and you're gonna put four fingers, thumb and middle fingers best, they're strongest, place them on the black ring that's behind the EF mount, and twist to the left as best you can. If it's brand new and you haven't changed the mount before, then you'll have to give it some force. Once you get it going though, take the camera, turn it back on the side, you'd mount the V-lock plate, once you do this, you'll be able to remove the mount. As you see here, there's the EF mount. Now take your PL mount. You're gonna to wanna to line it up with the contacts on the bottom. As you see the contacts around the bottom here. Go ahead and stab it. And we'll start rotating to the right ever so gently. There we go, got it seated. Little tip, every time you hit a resistance point, go ahead and wiggle the mount just a little bit. Just freeze it up to see if it has any more turning room, which this guy does have a bit more. Go ahead and flip it onto the battery lock plate back there. And just continue to turn, continue to wiggle. Basically, you wanna get the Allen head screws that you originally released, the set screws. You wanna get those back at 1030 and about three, and about three or four on the other side. You wanna go ahead and back, if they're not already backed out, back them out just a bit more. I have one here that's not backed out all the way. Go ahead and lock down the Allen head screws. Once they are tight, just a quarter past is all you need to do for torque. Boom, right there. And that's all that's to it. That is how you change the mount on your Vericam LT from EF to PL. To go the opposite way, it's just the same process in reverse. Thank you for watching, guys.